Hey guys, okay, so in today's video, I thought I would share with you an update on my laser hair removal journey. <laughs> Last night, I went for my eighth and final laser hair removal session. Um, basically, the lady that does my hair removal told me that I would need six to eight laser hair removal sessions. And then after that, there would be about an 80 to 90% reduction in the facial hair that I had on my face. And then after that, we could go into some electrolysis. Now, she said that if we feel like I need to go and do another round of laser hair, then we definitely can. But right now, she just wants to focus on the individual patches. So basically what we've noticed so far is that about 90% of the hair is gone, 80 to 90% of the hair is gone. In these clips here that I filmed the other day, you can see the patch under my chin is pretty, pretty extensive. And then a little bit under my nose and on the sides of my mouth as well. But you can see that from before, and I will post a photo from before, it is about 80 to 90% gone. And now when I shave every day, um, it's not that big of a deal. I barely get any ingrowns or anything anymore. When she did it last night, she was getting a lot of the hair carbonization, which is basically what you want to see when you're zapping hair. So she went pretty hard with it last night. Again, it doesn't tickle. It does hurt. It hurts quite a bit. Like, I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't tickle. It, it pretty, it hurts. But just think about it this way. If you're out there and you're trying to decide whether or not you want to do laser hair removal, or if you are going through it, power to ya. Um, but if you're out there and you're trying to decide if you're gonna get laser hair removal, and that's why you stumble across this video, just remember that it's like 20 minutes of pain once a month. Like, I would do it over a million times again to have a hair-free face. It's not that big of a deal. It does hurt and it is annoying, but you can get through it. It burns for a little bit, then you're red for a couple hours after, but then pretty much by the next day, it's completely fine. Sometimes when I've gone to sessions, I've gotten headaches from just the pain and the throbbing after, but again, nothing, nothing so bad that I couldn't do it and I wouldn't do it again. Do you know what I mean? It is definitely worth it to have a hair-free face. So yeah, I am super excited to start electrolysis and I will definitely keep you guys um, updated with my journey. I hope this video helps some of you that are out there. Um, I hope it is informative. Don't forget to follow my Instagram down below and subscribe so that you can stay updated with my journey and I will see you in my next video. Bye!